Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hi everyone Being someone who is fluent in English is certainly everyone's dream But have you ever thought about what step you should take to be fluent in English? Or how to, how to start if you want to learn English? And after you find the answer about the question have you ever thought how to improve your English skills? Here, I will explain st some steps that we can use to improve our English skills. But let me introduce myself. My name is Fitri Wahyuni Manurung, and I'm a student of the English Department, the Faculty of Teachers Training and Education of Muslim Nusantara Al Wasliya University. So, as I said before, I'm going to tell you about the step to improve our English skills, but you must love English first, because it will help you to enjoy your every single time that you will spend with English. Alright, let's we check it out what the steps about. First is listening. Listening is very important in learning a language. Effective listening ensures understanding and it helps improve accuracy when speaking, among other things. By listening actively, you can pay attention not only what is said, but also how it is said. So, try to listen to music or try to watch a movie TV series, entertainment, news, or shows, and pay attention to what you hear or listen. If you don't understand what the movie or the music is about, it's okay, no problem, because we want to make your ears will be getting used to the sounds of the language. The next step is reading. After being able to speak in English, of course, the next step is reading. This is important because you need uh, new words to speak right. The other way to get the new words except listening is reading. You can try to start with easy books, even children's books and comics. By reading, you can understand about the words Presses and expression represented by symbol. Plus, get to understand the grammar and the structure of the language used in the passage to read. And the last one is about writing. Actually, uh, writing is really the hardest thing for me to learn English. And of course, she also know about the reason, right? Yes, it's because about the grammar and the structure of the language. So, for the tips, you can write down words or expression you think are useful with their meaning and examples. Or, you can find activities to practice your writing skill, like write comments in English books or Find a website that provides free writing tasks. Alright, those are the tips that we can use to improve our English skills. But remember, the key to success in learning English is practice, practice, and practice. Try to do it as often and as much as possible to get the best result as you want. Baby, that's all what I can deliver to you. Hopefully, it's useful and thank you for your attention. And Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.